Hello YouTube and welcome to another episode of Pokemon Legends Arceus. Uh, I guess the Diamond, the Diamond, whoever's are here. Um, my mind, the Galaxy Hall is a fine building, even from the outside. The Galaxy team certainly got themselves a grand headquarters, I'll give them that. Oh yes, I came because I had some news that I thought you might be interested in. Better you actually see what's going on, then let's head to... What'd you end up calling it again? Heights Camp? Okay. Okay, here we are at the height. Oh. That's weird here. Oh, and uh, I did change my team. I added the Alpha Barrel to the team. I spoke to Weird Ear about what's going on. I told him that, okay. Is Weird Ear going to let me ride him then? Trust and appreciate. Weird Ear is worthy. Da -da 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 -da. Flute. So they're going to give me a flute so I can call Weird Ear. This is very important, so listen. That's the the intro to Pokemon Diamond. That's awesome. The Celestia flute that Mai just played. Okay. Okay, can I have it? I want to try riding Weird Ear. There must be Stantler around here. Because there were Scyther near where Cleaver is. Okay. Okay. And what's this? A mind plate from Weird Ear. Give psychic type of them. Oh, I can give it to uh to Mime Junior, I think. Can you give are, are there held items in this game? Let's see. Um, oh, it's a key item. Cool. Oh. Um, oh, that's unfortunate. <clears throat> uh, I've, I blacked out. Okay, uh, <laughs> did I have more XP candy than I just lost, or why did I lose XP candy? I didn't remember having that. Oh, well, let's, uh, use this to increase Bavaro's special attack and uh, let's try that again okay I kind of want to test out the barrel. Okay, let's, um... Starly ran away. Okay, uh, let's Icy Wind. Okay, that did a lot. Weirder is fast. But apparently I anger Pokemon like heck when I'm riding him. Oh, there's another Pikachu. Oh, shoot. Okay, let's, um... I don't want to kill it. Well, that did a lot. Uh, tackle. Tackle. Oh, that's unfortunate. Tackle. There we go. 
perfect. Less perfect. Okay, leave you on. Um, let's try a great ball. We haven't used a great ball yet, and we have them now, so. Okay, I will see you guys at the Cleaver Den. Okay, here we are, back at Cleaver's spot. So you say that you are gal that you galaxy people came up with the method to quell the frenzy. I actually have rain on my clothes. That's cool. What? You'll mash up Cleaver's favorite foods into balls and throw them as offerings? Well, that's quite an orthodox approach. You galaxy people, your inventiveness just blows me away. I mean, now can you make offerings Lord Cleaver from a safe distance? I'll lend you aid if it means we might provide Cleaver with his offerings. Okay. Whatever the plan is, you'll need Cleaver's favorite plum beans. I've brought them, as promised. God, that's right. My apologies. I totally forgot about you. I admit, as we haven't been able to solve this ourselves, we seem to have little choice but to turn to the Galaxy team. But even I still have my doubts about whether we should entrust such things to an outsider. So prove you're worthy against me. Okay. Sure. So this is their leader. Oh, she has a Glaceon. Interesting. Okay. Let's go with uh, with our agile style. Okay. Okay. Wait, why did it go twice? That was agile style. Okay, let's do strong style now. So that's gonna have more power and it, yeah. Cool. The trainer battles in this game are not hard. The wild battles and stuff are significantly harder than the trainer battles. Now I see, Pokeballs are simply your tools of choice, not products of, of disregard for Pokemon. You still understand that the Pokemon you've caught and treat them as partners. I feel better putting my trust in you. I think you, uh, you can, you can, oh, she's healing my Pokemon. Okay, cool. Are we doing this? Is, are we fighting Cleaver? So because you have to keep your distance, you'll mash Cleaver's favorite foods together to a ball and try to, okay, bombs. Okay. So we're going to, I already know what we're doing. We're throwing bombs at him. Let's do it. That's a big basket of them. Terrible mountain of bombs. That should please Cleaver, if anything. Now ready yourself, and I will summon the mighty... Okay. As I am. Okay. Almighty Cleaver, Cleaver, Lord of the Woods, though it isn't my yet the time of your ceremony, we prepared an offering of your favorite things. So Cleaver's gonna show up now? Grasha! Where is he? Is he in the tree? No, there he is. I feel like this is gonna be hard. Okay, Cleaver. Lord of the Woods Cleaver. Okay, I think I understand how to do this. This is... Changing direction is not... Easy. 
Okay. This isn't the hardest thing in the world, but it's definitely not easy. A hitting stance. Okay. Um. I don't know if roll out or well, water pulse. Oh, that's a lot. Okay. Good job, a barrel. Okay, let's just. Okay. This isn't too bad. Yeah, this isn't too bad at all. The dodging, the dodging is really intuitive. I'm just curious if, uh, if one hit will knock me out. I don't think I want to find out, though. Okay. Air slash, and Bavaro avoided the attack. Great job, Bavaro. Hit him with a water pulse. Stealth rock, I think I'll. Oh, no, won't count. Awesome job, Bavaro. wasn't bad I think it's funny that I'm just throwing food at uh, at Cleaver just chucking his favorite food at him ooh lots of XP He's, he, he looks like he's shrunk. Oh, he gave me an insect plate. Cool. It allows... When used on a certain Pokemon, it allows it to gain the power of the bug type. So we have to get all the plates, and I have two of them so far? What happened? Some kind of light inter erupted from Cleaver's body. Has Lord Cleaver's frenzy mind truly been put to ease now? Does this confirm that the strange lightning was to blame for Cle Cleaver's unnatural behavior? Maybe. Well, this is what I think after all, all we've seen. We know strange lightning came out of the space rift the other night. Those bolts must have struck Cle Cleaver and driven him into a frenzy after all. The lightning came from the sp space-time rift. But all money Sitto really does dwell beyond the space time rift than that than the stra strange lightning it indeed was almighty Sitto's power then were we even right to try to interfere I happily went along with the plan to create some bombs as if I knew that what I was doing like some kind of thoughtless fool outrageous calm yourself remember that Lord of the woods has been has long been our protector, keeping the Pearl Clan safe from dangerous Pokemon that might harm us. Would powers sent by the true Almighty Sinnoh have driven Cleaver to turn on us and attack people in people and Pokemon indiscriminately? Discriminately? I doubt it. What Cure accomplished just now, it needed to be done. I'm glad we could settle this without further strife with the Diamond Clan or Galaxy team. If you come across other Pokemon in the grip of the painful, please send them. Okay. Yes, fine, I suppose I can concur. I apologize for becoming briefly incomposed. I'm grateful for what you've done for my lord. Please take these on behalf of the Poro clan. Consider it an apology. 
What are you giving me? Citrus berry? It's citrus berries. Okay. Let me care for your Pokemon as well. I think I've finally come to believe that you truly did fall out of the sky. Though I still can't imagine the reasons for it. And it seems we've settled things here. Though, between you and me, I wouldn't mind seeing Cleaver in a frenzy again. He was furiously strong. Okay. And I think that's where we're going to end this episode. So if you guys enjoyed, thank you for watching. And leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.